What kind of stories would you like to hear? Click on a theme. Animals. Pick an animal story. Here we go. A frog in the tree. Click on the big button to listen to the story. Click on one of the small buttons to do an activity. Let's go. This is the story of a frog in the tree. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Molly is licking an ice cream cone. It tastes delicious. Look, a frog is sitting up in the tree. Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
A frog in the tree. Here we go. Click on the frog. Excellent. Click on a tree branch. Correct. Click on the ice cream cone. Super. Click on Molly. Right on. Click on Molly's tongue. Wow! A frog in the tree. Here we go. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly is walking and licking an ice cream cone. Excellent. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly sits next to a tree. The frog hops in the tree. Correct. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly stops licking. The frog jumps out of the tree. Super. Click on the picture that matches these words. Oh no! The frog jumps into the ice cream cone. Right on! A frog in the tree. Okay! Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent! Put the story in order. Correct! Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! A frog in the tree. Pick an animal story. Here we go! Catch that rabbit. Click on the big... This story is called Catch That Rabbit. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Look! The rabbit is hopping out of the box. Oh no! Matt and Molly have to catch that rabbit. Molly gets a carrot. Matt gets a stick and some string. They have an idea. Matt hangs the carrot from the stick. The rabbit sees the carrot and starts to hop back. Rabbit. Matt holds. Matt hangs the carrot from the stick. The rabbit sees the carrot and starts to hop back. Rabbits love carrots. Matt holds the carrot over the box. The rabbit hops to get the carrot. He lands in the box. Yay! Matt and Molly catch the rabbit. Catch that rabbit. Okay. Is Molly in this story? Excellent. Is Matt in this story? Correct. Is a hamster in this story? Super! Is a rabbit in this story? Right on! Do rabbits fly? Wow! 
Do rabbits hop? Excellent. Does the rabbit hop out of the box? Correct. Does Matt hang a banana from a stick? Super! Does Matt hang a carrot from a stick? Right on! Do Matt and Molly catch the rabbit? Wow! Catch that rabbit! Let's go! What animal is in this story? A rabbit. A dog. Excellent! What does the rabbit do? Flies. Hops. Correct! What does Matt use to catch the rabbit? A carrot. An ice cream cone. Super! Where does Matt hang the carrot? Under the box. Over the box. Right on! What does the rabbit jump into? A box. A tree. Wow! Catch that rabbit. Here we go! Click on the rabbit. Excellent! Click on the carrot. Correct. Click on the stick. Super! Click on the string. Right on! Click on the box. Correct! Catch that rabbit. Here we go! Click on the picture that matches these words. The rabbit is hopping out of the box. Excellent! Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly gets a carrot. Matt gets a stick and string. Correct! Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt hangs the carrot from the stick. Super! Click on the picture that matches these words. The rabbit hops to get the carrot. He lands in the box. Right on! Catch that rabbit. OK! Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent! Put the story in order. Correct! Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! 
Excellent. Catch that rabbit. Pick an animal story. Let's go. A mouse in my house. Click on the big button to listen to the story. Click on one of the small buttons to do an activity. Here we go. This story is a mouse in my house. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Molly sees a mouse behind her. She screams. Molly is afraid of the mouse. Molly climbs up onto a chair. The mouse runs under the chair. Molly screams, Help! Matt! Matt comes into the room. He points to the mouse and starts to laugh. Molly is confused. Matt puts a cage down on the floor. He opens the little door and in runs the mouse. Matt says, This is my mouse. He's my pet. Molly starts to laugh too. She is not afraid of the mouse anymore. A mouse in my house. Oh! Is Molly in this story? Excellent! Is Matt in this story? Correct! Does Molly see a tiger? Super! Does Molly see a snake? Right on! Does Molly see a mouse? Wow! Is Molly afraid of the mouse? Excellent! Does Molly climb onto a table? Correct! Does Molly climb onto a chair? Super! Does Molly call Matt to come and help her? Right on! Is the mouse Matt's pet? Wow! A mouse in my house. What animal is in this story? A frog. A mouse. Excellent! Who sees a mouse in this story? Matt. Molly. Correct! Who screams? Matt. Molly. Super! What does Molly get on to get away from the mouse? A chair. A table. Right on! Who helps Molly? Matt. A dog. Wow! A mouse in my house. Here we go! Click on the mouse. Excellent! Click on the chair. Correct! Click under the chair. Super! Click on someone who is confused. Super! Click on the cage. Wow! 
a mouse in my house. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly sees a mouse. She screams. Excellent. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly gets on the chair. She screams, Help! Matt! Correct! Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt points to the mouse and starts to laugh. Super! Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt puts his pet mouse in its cage. Right on! A mouse in my house. OK! Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent! Put the story in order. Correct! Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! A mouse in my house. Pick an animal story. OK! Come down, monkey! Click on the big button to listen to the story. Click on one of the small buttons to do an activity. Here we go! This story is called Come Down, Monkey. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Matt and Molly see a monkey. The monkey is climbing up a tree. The monkey is hanging from the tree. Matt tries to reach him, but the monkey is too high. Molly is worried that the monkey will fall. Matt gets an idea. He puts a banana at the bottom of the tree. The monkey sees the banana. The monkey climbs down to get the banana. Monkeys love bananas. Hooray! The monkey is safe. Matt and Molly are happy. Come down, monkey. OK. Is Molly in this story? Excellent. Is Matt in this story? Correct. Is a cat in this story? Super! Is a monkey in this story? Right on! Does the monkey climb up a tree? Wow! Can Matt reach the monkey? Excellent! Does the monkey fall out of the tree? Correct! Does Matt put an apple at the bottom of the tree? Super! Does Matt put a banana at the bottom of the tree? Right on! 
Do monkeys love bananas? Wow! Come down, monkey. Let's go. Who sees a monkey in this story? Matt. A duck. Excellent. What is the monkey climbing? A chair. A tree. Correct. What does Matt put by the tree? A pizza. A banana. Super! Where does Matt put the banana? At the bottom of the tree. On the tree. Right on! What does the monkey eat? A banana. A bone. Wow! Come down, monkey. Here we go. Click on the monkey. Excellent. Click on something that is high in the tree. Correct. Click on someone who is worried. Click on the banana. Right on. Click on the bottom of the tree. Wow! Come down, monkey. Here we go. Click on the picture that matches these words. The monkey is climbing up a tree. Excellent. Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt tries to reach the monkey. He is too high. Correct. Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt puts a banana at the bottom of the tree. Super! Click on the picture that matches these words. The monkey climbs down to get the banana. Right on! Come down, monkey. OK. Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent. Put the story in order. Correct. Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent. Come down, monkey. Pick an animal story. Here we go. The Hungry Cat. Click on the big button to listen to the story. Click on one of the small buttons to do an activity. Here we go. This is the story of the Hungry Cat. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Matt and Molly see a cat. The cat looks sad. He says, meow. 
Matt gives a bone to the cat. Molly says, Cats don't like bones, dogs do. Matt thinks again about what to give the cat. Matt gives a slice of pizza to the cat. Molly says, Cats don't like pizza, people do. Molly gets an idea about what to give the cat. Molly gives some tuna to the cat. Cats love tuna. Hooray! The cat is happy. The hungry cat. Okay. Is there a lion in this story? Excellent. Is there a rabbit in this story? Correct. Is there a cat in this story? Super. Does the cat say ruff, ruff? Right on. Does the cat say meow? Excellent. Does the cat like the bone? Excellent. Does the cat like the pizza? Correct. Does the cat like the tuna? Right on. Does the tuna make the cat feel sad? Right on. Does the tuna make the cat feel happy? Wow! The hungry cat. Let's go. What animal do Matt and Molly see? A frog. A cat. Excellent. How does the cat feel at the beginning of the story? Happy. Sad. Correct. What does Matt give the cat first? A bone. A banana. Super! What does Matt give the cat second? Pizza. Tuna. Right on! What does Molly give the cat? A carrot. Tuna. Wow! The hungry cat. Here we go! Click on the cat. Excellent! Click on the bone. Correct! Click on the pizza. Super! Click on someone who is thinking. Right on! Click on the tuna. Wow! The hungry cat. Here we go! Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt and Molly see a cat. The cat says, Meow. Excellent. Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt gives a bone to the cat. Cats don't eat bones. Correct. 
click on the picture that matches these words. Matt gives pizza to the cat. Cats don't like pizza. Super! Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly gives tuna to the cat. Cats love tuna. Right on! The hungry cat. OK! Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent! Put the story in order. Correct! Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! The Hungry Cat. Pick an animal story. Let's go! A very cold dog. Here we go! This story is called A Very Cold Dog. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Matt and Molly are taking the dog for a walk. It is snowing and cold outside. Matt and Molly are wearing hats on their heads. Matt and Molly are also wearing mittens on their hands. Matt and Molly look at the dog. The dog is shaking. He is very cold. Matt and Molly feel sorry for the cold dog. Hmm. Matt gets an idea. Matt puts his hat on the dog's tail. Molly puts her hat on the dog's head. They put their mittens on the dog's paws. Now the dog is nice and warm. The dog is happy. A very cold dog. OK. Is it raining in this story? Excellent. Is it snowing in this story? Correct! Are Matt and Molly walking a cat? Super! Are they walking a hamster? Right on! Are they walking a dog? Wow! Do Matt and Molly wear hats on their hands? Excellent! Do Matt and Molly wear hats on their heads? Correct! Do they wear mittens on their hands? Super! Do Matt and Molly put a coat on the dog? Right on! Do they put their hats and mittens on the dog? Right on! A very cold dog. Let's go! Who is in this story? Matt. A cat. Excellent! 
Who is cold? Molly. A dog. Correct. What does Molly put on her head? A hat. An ice cream cone. Super. Where does Matt put his hat? On the dog's tail. On the dog's head. Right on. Where do Matt and Molly put their mittens? On the dog's head. On the dog's paws. Wow! A very cold dog. Here we go. Click on the dog. Excellent. Click on a hat. Correct. Click on a mitten. Super. Click on a tail. Right on. Click on a paw. Wow. A very cold dog. Here we go. Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt and Molly are walking the dog. Excellent. Click on the picture that matches these words. The dog is shaking. He is very cold. Correct. Click on the picture that matches these words. Hmm. Matt gets an idea. Super. Click on the picture that matches these words. They put their hats and mittens on the dog. Right on. A very cold dog. Okay. Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent. Put the story in order. Correct. Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! A very cold dog. Pick an animal story. Here we go! Feeding a duck. Click on the big button to listen to the story. Click on one of the small buttons to do an activity. Here we go! This story is called Feeding a Duck. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Look, it's a duck. He is hungry. The duck is saying, quack, quack. Molly has a bag of crackers to feed the duck. Molly is throwing crackers to the duck. Matt is hungry, too. He gets an idea. Look, Matt is pretending to be a duck. He is sitting like a duck. Matt is saying, quack, quack, like a duck, too. Molly, look, Matt is pre 
Molly thinks Matt is funny. She throws some crackers to Matt. Mmm. Feeding a duck. Okay. Is Molly in this story? Excellent. Is Matt in this story? Correct. Is a dog in this story? Super. Is a duck in this story? Right on. Does a duck say moo? Wow. Does a duck say quack? Excellent. Does Molly throw crackers to the duck? Correct. Is Matt hungry too? Super. Does Matt pretend to be a frog? Right on. Does Matt pretend to be a duck? Wow. Feeding a duck. Let's go. What animal is in this story? A cat. A duck. Excellent. What does a duck say? Meow. Quack. Correct. What does Molly throw to the duck? Crackers. Pizza. Super. What does Matt pretend to be? A rabbit. A duck. Right on. What does Molly throw to Matt? A bone. Crackers. Wow. Feeding a duck. Here we go. Click on the duck. Excellent. Click on quack. Correct. Click on the bag. Super. Click on the crackers. Super. Click on someone acting funny. Super. Feeding a duck. Here we go. Click on the picture that matches these words. The duck is hungry. He is saying, quack, quack. Excellent. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly is throwing crackers to the duck. Correct. Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt is pretending to be a duck. Super. Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly throws some crackers to Matt. Right on. Feeding a duck. Okay. Click on each picture 
and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent! Put the story in order. Correct! Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! Feeding a duck. Pick an animal story. Here we go! One cold fish. Click on the big button to listen to the story. Click on one of the small buttons to do an activity. Here we go! This story is called One Cold Fish. It has four parts. Click on the arrow to listen to the story. Matt and Molly are shivering. Their pet fish is shivering too. They are cold, cold, cold. Molly puts a hat on her head. She feels much warmer now. Oh no! Matt and the fish are still cold. Matt puts a hat on his head. He feels much warmer now. Oh no! The fish is still cold. Molly gets an idea. She puts a hat on top of the fish's bowl. The fish feels much warmer now. Everyone is warm and happy. One cold fish. Is Molly in this story? Excellent. Is Matt in this story? Correct. Is a dog in this story? Super! Is a cat in this story? Right on! Is a fish in this story? Wow! Are Matt, Molly, and the fish cold? Excellent! Does Molly put a boot on her head? Correct! Does Molly put a hat on her head? Super! Does Matt put a hat on his head? Right on! Does Molly put a hat on the fishbowl? Wow! One cold fish. Let's go! Who is cold in this story? Matt. A dog. Excellent! What kind of pet is in this story? A fish. A cat. Correct! What does Molly put on her head? Mittens. A hat. Super! Where does the fish live? In a box. In a bowl. Right on! 
Where does Molly put the fish's hat? On its head. On the bowl. Wow! One cold fish. Here we go. Click on the fish. Excellent. Click on a hat. Correct. Click on Matt's head. Super! Click on the person who is shivering. Right on! Click on the fish bowl. Wow! One cold fish. Here we go! Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt, Molly, and their pet fish are shivering. Excellent! Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly puts a hat on her head. Correct! Click on the picture that matches these words. Matt puts a hat on his head. Super! Click on the picture that matches these words. Molly puts a hat on top of the fish's bowl. Right on! One cold fish. Okay! Click on each picture and drag it to its place in the story. Click on the green button when you are finished to see if you are correct. Excellent! Put the story in order. Correct! Put the story in order. Super! Put the story in order. Right on! Put the story in order. Excellent! One cold fish. Pick an animal story. What kind of stories would you like to hear? Click on a theme.